As South Africa commemorates the 31st anniversary of the assassination of Chris Hani, ANC Secretary General Fiki Mbalula reflects on Hani's enduring legacy and laments that political turmoil unfolding within the country. Addressing the somber occasion, Balula underscores Hani's unwavering commitment to the ANC and the struggle for liberation, contrasting it with the diversive actions of certain individuals, including former President Jacob Zuma, who have veered from the path of the revolution. Speaking at the commemorative event, Balula refrains from directly naming Zuma, but alludes to his departure from the ANC to form a splinter party, challenging the ruling party at the polls. Drawing parallels between Hani's steadfast dedication to the ANC's ideals and Zuma's defection, Mbalula expresses disbelief at the betrayal of the revolution by those entrusted with leadership roles within the party. Mbalula highlights Hani's profound belief in the historical roots of Umkonto Asizwe, the military wing of the ANC, which was formed in 1961 in collaboration with the South African Communist Party. Hani's assassination in April 10, 1993, marked a tragic loss for the ANC and the nation, underscoring the, si underscoring the sacrifices made by individuals like Hani in the pursuit of freedom and justice. Reflecting on Hani's legacy, Mbalula emphasizes the importance of preserving historical truths and combating attempts to distort or revise the narrative surrounding the MK's origins. He asserts that Hani will be dismayed by efforts to downplay the ANC and SACP's role in forming MK, emphasizing the pivotal role played by these organizations in the armed struggle against apartheid. Expressing disappointment at the current state of affairs, Balula laments the erosion of ethical leadership within the ANC and the emergence of corruption and betrayal for the revolutionary ideals espoused by figures like Hani. He contrasts Hani's exemplary leadership with the legacy of state capture and corruption that has tarnished the ANC's reputation in recent years. In a thinly veiled critique of Zuma's leadership and his legal battles with the ANC, Balula acknowledges the challenges faced by the party in navigating internal divisions and external pressures. Despite legal victories secured by Zuma's party in the electoral court, Balula underscores the ANC's commitment to upholding democratic principles and transparency in the electoral process. Looking ahead, Balula reaffirms the ANC's resolve to confront corruption and restore public trust, echoing Hani's vision of a united and principled movement committed to advancing the interests of all South Africans. As the country grapples with the legacies of its past and the uncertainties of its future, Balula's reflections of Hani's legacy serves as a poignant reminder of the values and the principles that continue to guide the ANC's struggles for a better South Africa. For this and much more from Southern TV, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and be sure to turn on that notification bell and leave your comment in the comment section down below so as you can get more updates.